Oh my God. Okay, when you think you're done, hit him with some half reps. Same thing applies in the bedroom. And if you already are doing half reps, hit him with some quarter reps. <laughs> Just try your best, man. What's up guys? Jesse James West here. Hope you're having a great day. You used to say that all the time. We're having some pre-workout right now, Firefly Lemonade. We just wrapped up filming for a main channel video. We are now gonna be going to hit a back workout, but we're doing one scoop of hyperhydration with two scoops of nitric. Code Jesse on this stuff. You really got, if you really wanna see some gains. The greatest thing about a home gym is that it's right in your basement. Honestly, like a day like today, where it's like a rainy day, is probably the greatest time to work out at home. I don't really feel like doing shit, but because this is here, I have no excuse not to. Starting off the day with some pull-ups. I'm only gonna do like three sets. Just kinda go to ultimate failure on three. I feel like especially pull-ups, if you're gonna go to failure, doing a fourth and a fifth set is gonna be really difficult if you're really pushing yourself. So let's see what we got, baby. Alexa, louder. Oh, I got one more at least. <laughs> I'm so tired. But you gotta move, baby. All I listen to is falling in reverse. So Ronnie Radke, I know you're probably watching this. Let's collab, bro. We'll, we'll go main channel with that shit. I honestly try to find inspiration from outside of the fitness industry. Like I honestly unsubscribed from everybody in the fitness industry because I felt like it was clouding my judgment of what to make. Because you gotta make what you wanna make. You gotta make authentic stuff that your fans that you've built want to watch. Looking at other people is a deadly comparison that you don't want to do. Pump cover's coming off. I honestly don't want to keep it on. 183 in the morning. Last set, baby. We're feeling ourselves. My chest is sore from yesterday's workout. If you didn't watch that one, go make sure you go back because I'm doing a whole training series right now. For the next few days, we're going to be doing every single workout in the week. So make sure you guys are stay tuned and subscribe. Let's go. We're gonna make our way right over here and we're gonna be doing lat pull downs. We're gonna do a neutral grip. I don't really like going uh, with that typical bar. I just don't feel it as much. So we're gonna go here and we're gonna be doing three sets. I don't do anything more than three sets. I got 150 pounds on the bar and we're gonna superset this with, can you guess it? Pullovers. Oh my God, you guys are predicting my workout to this point. Biggest thing I wanna say for any sort of back exercise, a lot of people always feel it in their forearm. In my opinion, I honestly pretend I don't have a thumb. So my fingers have a lot of power. So I'm gonna go over the bar and I'm not even gonna focus on my thumb. I'm not gonna like grab it with my thumb. I'm not gonna like be using my thumb here and like, or anything like that. We're just gonna literally make our hands like little like cup holders. Bing, grab on and just pull. Let your back do everything. Go lighter, superset stuff, drop set stuff to feel it. Instead of going heavier and heavier, you're not gonna feel it if you just go heavy. And then <clears throat> pull with the elbows. <clears throat> Oh my God, oh my God. Okay, when you think you're done, hit him with some half reps. Same thing applies in the bedroom. And if you already are doing half reps, hit him with some quarter reps. Just try your best, man. If you ever see someone supersetting this, know them, Jesse James sent them. Mm. Mm. Ah. Oh my God, it burns so bad, bro. Right here is where I normally would stop. But since I'm a man, I'm gonna keep going. Ah. Oh. Something that I've thought about is, you know, my role as someone on the internet. You know, I, I, I wanna be a motivator. I wanna be someone that inspires people. And I was like, what am I inspiring them for? You know, there's people that are gonna inspire for muscle money, cars, women, whatever. I feel like I can I can attest to chasing your dreams and pushing yourself so hard and getting all the hard work done and doing things that people think you're insane for. I think this home gym that you see around me right now is a testament of believing in yourself. If you, if you don't believe in yourself, you are never going to make it, never going to succeed. That's why people that come up to me and they're like, bro, one day we're gonna collab. One day I'm gonna be making videos with you. You know, those are the people that I love. I love meeting everybody, but those are the people that stand out because I, I can tell there's a sincerity to it where they really do believe that they are gonna be collaborating with me one day. And I always say, I'll see you at the top, baby. I'll see you there, all right? And it's so cool because that's how my mindset was when I first started doing YouTube. We're all humans, we're all in this game together. We're all doing everything for the first time. We're trying our best. But if you believe you can accomplish so much more 
And if you don't, lie to yourself until it becomes the truth. I don't know what to tell you, but find a way to believe. Because once you do, your life will change forever. All right, so we're gonna go over to the dumbbells. We'll do some dumbbell rows. There's two ways for me to do rows. You could do them like this, your legs staggered, okay? You could do them like this, which honestly, right there, boom, I already feel that better, so that's what I'm gonna go with today. It's gonna target a bit more of that like mid lat and upper back, but it's fine. Let's go. Okay, so with that set, first thing I noticed is after five reps, I really did not feel it the best. So I'm gonna lighten it. I'm gonna do 80s and I'm gonna slow it down. Holy shit, I'm gonna drop dead right now. Oxygen, where are you? Do my lats are popping. You have to learn how to do shit you don't wanna do as if it's your favorite thing to do. If you're a disciplined person, keyword discipline, not motivated, you're gonna do it. You're gonna get it in. <laughs> felt really good. 80s felt a lot better. I'm gonna do one more set. I'm not gonna show it. I'm just gonna do it for, uh, for Snapchat. Add me on Snapchat, Jesse43West. I vlog there daily, guys, literally every day. Alexa, next. Brother. My Alexa is playing the weirdest music, and if I set off your Alexa, comment down below. By saying its name, I guarantee I did. Hey Alexa, play hardcore All right, we're doing some shrugs. My trap, dude, I've never been able to feel them, never been able to get them sore. Along with my shoulders, I really struggle, and that's why they're both my weak points. And try to just contract. All right, got a little bit of a pump. We're gonna go up 25 pounds. Now I normally do like 225, but I'm gonna try doing a higher rep today. I think the biggest thing with training is not being afraid to try different things. This is whenever someone says, what's your piece of advice? Be a student of the game. If you can learn more, you will literally be a better athlete, person, entrepreneur, boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever, doesn't matter, son. If you can learn how to operate better, how to do things properly, how to make better choices, it all adds up, man. Asking questions, man, don't be afraid. Even someone like me, ask me a question. In fact, let's do that. Everyone comment down below a question you have about fitness. And I'm gonna answer it in the next episode. I'm gonna count to 10, and then I'm gonna do as many reps again. I'm gonna do rest pause set. So basically you take a 10 second break, pause the set, and get back into it. <laughs> Holy dude, it feels like I'm wearing a pack strap. But my traps are so pumped. I'm gonna take that as a win. So it's crazy, I've done three exercise, four exercises, sorta, because we had a super set. So we've only done a few exercises, and like my back is shot. So I'm gonna do one more finisher, two to three sets, single arm pull downs. We're basically just gonna rep it out until I can't do no more. And that's gonna be it, literally for the back workout. <laughs> All right, the final exercise. We feel good right now. We're gonna finish off three sets. We're demolishing our arms. We've not accepted defeat yet. We're gonna push our boundaries right now. I wanna do 50s, I'm gonna do 70s. Why? Cause why not? That's what you should be asking yourself. Ladies and gentlemen, that's it. This is gonna be one of the most elite Stay Relentless Society channels. I, I came up with that yesterday. The Stay Relentless Society is something more. It's something grand, and you're a part of it. Subscribe, turn your post notifications, and of course, stay relentless. Peace.